way to go. Great job. <laughs> <laughs> it's a third season of the Wisconsin turkey hunt. On this day, our turkey calling magician Dan Shafter is behind the camera calling for Caitlin Rohr. He's good. He's down. He's down. Don't worry. I've had a turkey run away before. Nope. He's dead. Okay. He's just doing his thing. There's, <laughs> there's still hens running around here. They don't know what's going on. Caitlin. Yeah. Way to go. Good <laughs> shot. Good shot. Good shot. I've shot a turkey before and it ran away after. Yeah, I know this, but you got him. This gun is. This gun. This gun is like magic. <laughs> right, that hen's just, just sitting there looking at me. She can't believe her lover is dead. Look at her, she's standing right there. High fives. <laughs> cool. That guy's pretty nice. He has a nice beard. The other one behind him was, was a, a Tom too. He had a smaller beard. I was hoping I could draw him up here yeah. with a little hen talk, but they nice shot, yeah. Thanks for letting me use your gun. My gun never misses. Well, should we go look at the bird? Yeah. All right, let's go do that. Yeah. Our mission is to help bow hunters maximize their potential with a well-built, finely tuned arrow, one that they can trust to get the job done every time. If that's the kind of quality you want, Check out the veteran-owned Adams Precision Archery. All right, here's our blind. It was kind of nice we had a live decoy out here. Yeah. <laughs> a live decoy. Always nice to have live decoys. I didn't even look at the time here. You must have shot it just shortly after six. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. Our heater ran out too. I didn't want to stay in there and get cold any longer. I'm thinking, she better hurry up and shoot one because <laughs> I'm getting cold in here. Yeah. Now we don't have to come out tomorrow. No, you don't, yeah. We can go right to church tomorrow. Yeah, I mean, And thank God. Boy, what a nice day though, wow. Yeah. It is, yeah. I mean, the sun's so coming cool. up and, yeah. As Dan was headed back to the truck, he heard some soft grunts in the woods. Upon further investigation, it was porcupines getting frisky. <laughs> <laughs> 